Now, when it comes to finding the perfect location to call home, there's an age-old argument when it comes to coast versus country. Now, if I was to tell you that the property that we're here to show you today is a perfect combination of both, is that something that would pique your interest? If the answer to that question is yes, then make sure that you stay tuned to today's feature, because the property that we're here to show you is just minutes away from Ray Green, where you join me at the moment. Now, on countless occasions since 1959, this spot has been repeatedly crowned the best kept village in Lancashire. And on days like today, with the sun shining and the beams glistening over the duck pond or the dub, as locals would say in the background, it's very easy to see why. Having said that, we're still a matter of minutes away from the seafront and from Lytham Green, where locals have played host to musicians from all over the planet in recent years. Names such as Kylie Minogue and Rod Stewart have all made an appearance. Now, having said that, there's only one star of today's show, and that's the superb end of terrace property that I'm here to show you. Now, today's home is in moving condition. It's been extended, and in our view, would make a brilliant purchase for anyone looking for a semi-rural lifestyle. So if that sounds like something that could be a good fit for you then please stay tuned to today's property welcome to escape to the file Welcome to Holmley on Lytham Road. Now the property that I'm here to show you is this gorgeous end of terraced Victorian home that you can see behind me. Now the build itself dates back to the 1890s and when the property was first built, it was done so to house the corker workers. So to quite literally give accommodation to the men who built these wonderful surroundings with their bare hands. I thought that was a wonderful bit of history, but fast forward to today, as you can see, we've got a property that oozes curb appeal. We've got this landscape garden with floral surroundings and as well as that we've got two private off-road parking spots. Now that's enough about this gorgeous property from the outside, let's take a look at what's on the inside. So as soon as you walk through the door, the first word that springs to mind is homely. I love all of these antique feature details and we've even got a bespoke custom tiled wall which bears the namesake of this property. Now as we come into the entrance hallway, typical of a property from this period, we've got a nice wide entrance hallway, we've got these beautiful character details, high ceilings and coving which surrounds. Now the first of our reception rooms is on the right hand side, so let's take a look in there. So the quality laminate flooring that we saw in the entrance hallway extends round to the family lounge, which is positioned at the front elevation of the property. Now this room benefits from dual aspect bay windows, which give you an uninterrupted view to the leafy outlook to the front. Now the room itself has been finished to a good, clean, crisp and contemporary standard. We've got this gorgeous electric feature fireplace, which sits on this tiled platform with tiles that are inspired by the Victorian era. Now, of course, being so close to Living Green, musical references are never too far away. So if the first reception room and my musical references hit the right note with you, then wait until you see the second reception room currently used as a family dining room. Now we've got this double glazed window which brings ample natural light into this space, as well as giving you a peek into the private courtyard to the side. Now this room for me is packed with character and tradition. I love these overhanging feature lights and of course this exposed brickwork fireplace which really does add an abundance of character to this space. So as you can see behind me, we've got the family kitchen again absolutely steeped with tradition we've got the exposed timber features on the roof with terracotta flooring hand-built solid wood units an electric range and a built-in microwave as well as that we've got ample storage and this space leads on to the extension to the rear so beyond the family kitchen, the vendors have increased the square footage of this property by adding this extension. Now we've got a utility space which paves way onto this additional reception room. Now the space is currently being used as a music room slash study, but it could just as easily be used as a bedroom. On top of that, it's served by an ensuite which sits just behind the utility space. So that concludes the tour of the property downstairs. Let's see what this home has got to offer on the upstairs. Now the family bathroom has got a real royal finish to it, not just because of the size, but because of the fixtures and fittings. We've got this gorgeous roll top freestanding bath, a toilet and a wash basin, as well as a part tiled wall. 
So if you thought that all the character packed features in this property were confined to the ground floor, then you'd be wrong. Just take a look at this gorgeous original fireplace, which is a real focal point in the master bedroom. Now this space is a good size double bedroom. The current vendors have got two good size wardrobes. On top of that, we've got an ensuite just behind me. The second double bedroom on the top floor faces the rear of the property and again has got ample room for storage. Our third bedroom sits at the end of the hallway alongside the master bedroom. This single room has got a double glazed window overlooking the private grounds to the front. So the well insulated loft can be accessed by the drop down ladders that come from the hatch behind me. Now it's absolutely enormous up there and subject to getting the relevant plans and permissions could potentially add another floor of living. But that's enough about the property on the inside. Let's take a look at those amazing views that we spoke of earlier. So when I said that this property gives you the most amazing views to the rear, guys, I wasn't joking. Welcome to your private balcony and just look at these amazing views of the uninterrupted farmland that we've got to the back. Can you imagine coming out here every morning with your morning coffee or sitting out here to relax after a long day with your gin and tonic? So if you like what you've heard and seen on today's video, then please do give me a call directly to arrange your very own private viewing. My name's Ben. Thank you for watching.